Hello everyone, and how are you guys doing today? Um, today I basically really wanted to cover, um, it gets better. Um, it does get better. Um, we really do not realize, um, what we have in our life until we lose it sometimes. And we always feel that the walls are always crumbling and crashing inwards, and we feel like that there's no hope, there's no... Um, way we're going to get out of this. Um, it will not get better. Just things are going to just end up getting worse and worse as times go by. But I myself had a strong experience with that and almost ended my life. Um, I think when I was like 22 or 23, I almost ended my life. I really thought that I was not meant to be here. I thought that I couldn't make any friends. I was just a burden to people. Um, I was very confused growing up, um, especially in my teenage years. Um, for me, being gay, that was also a struggle and going to a Christian school as well and being told that gay was bad and, you know, you were going to hell and, and it was just so many things. It, it really put a lot of struggle in me and not being able to talk to anybody, not have any friends. Um, I isolated myself completely um, oh, from family, from any kind of friends, from even trying to make any friends. And as I did that, I became a loner. Um, I just had myself and my thoughts. And when you, when you experience something like that, um, just your thoughts alone will pretty much drive you crazy a little bit because when you continue processing that you're no good, that, you know, you're not going to amount to anything, you're just going to be, you know, by yourself and you're not going to have friends and you're not going to, you know, all these negative things, you start eventually believing them. And when you start believing them, you doubt yourself and you doubt even being here, you know. Um, and one thing, you know, I did get out of that. Um, it was a hard struggle, and I did eventually get out of that, and I opened my eyes to a new, a new me, you know, and it, it is hard, you know, when you feel like there's no exit, you know, it's like, how do you get to that point? How do you get to that level to where you can feel confident about yourself? to where you can feel like, you know what, I am important, you know, I'm amazing, I'm, I'm a unique individual, um, and anything that I do is going to be amazing, you know, how do you get out of that slump, and, and that is a hard thing, and that's something that you have to do, you have to believe in yourself, um, you have to look deep within yourself and know, because so many people can tell you that you're beautiful, that you're special, that you're amazing, um, you're unique, and um, everyone loves you. Um, but you have to love yourself. And for, let's see, I'm 32 years old, and now I can finally say, you know, I do love myself. I love myself from within to without. And, you know, a lot of people look at appearances from the outside, and that is the first thing people judge you on is, you're outside before they get to know who you are from the inside. And, you know, I wish people didn't do that. You know, I wish people would give people an opportunity and a chance for um, them to talk to those people. But in reality, it doesn't happen that way. But if you love yourself, and no matter what anybody says, you know, do not listen to the negative people. Do not listen to the ones who want to bring you down and, and tell you that you are no good, you know, because realistically, there's something about them that they hate that you have. So it, a lot of it is jealousy. You know, sometimes it is jealousy because maybe they want what you have. And so the only way they can do that is to pick on you. And I just want you guys to know out there that um, things will change things will get better um, as each day comes and goes you know that right there is a a wonderful gift and you know you guys are the heroes the ones that are going every day in these battles and and you're just trying to make it through the next day and 
to somewhat hold hope, you know, you are the heroes, and um, I just want to tell you that continue pressing forward and continue making a difference, you know, because one day you're going to look at all of this, you know, and you're going to look back and be like, wow, look how far I've come, and and that is something that I can see within myself, and if you don't believe me, um, definitely check out my old videos. I have my very first video that I posted on here, and I can see such a difference, and that was like a year and a half ago, so we we change as as the years go by, you know, the way we think, the way we act, the way we even dress sometimes, you know, our our sense of what we like and what we don't like changes, you know, um, as time goes by. So you may like anime, you know, um, and then maybe six years down the road you might not like anime, you know. So to continue pressing forward, um, that is the biggest advice I can give you. Do not listen to anyone that's negative. Um, Believe me, I've listened to so much negativity, and it will crumble you down um, if you allow it to happen. But I refuse, and that is the one thing I can tell you, is refuse to let that happen to you. Continue, no matter how many negative things are hitting your head, continue to tell yourself that you're beautiful, you're amazing, this is going to be an amazing day. And if it's not an amazing day, tomorrow will come. Tomorrow is a fresh new day. Tomorrow is going to be even better for you. And, you know, you're going to get through this. We're going to make it through this. And um, there will be some ups. There will be some downs. Um, not every day will be a great day for you. Um, but just treasure the moments that you have. Um, anything that happens to you, just treasure it. You know, I am so thankful for all the things that have come into my life right now. I am thankful for being able to do this video right now because... I was very shy, and like I said, if you were to tell me a couple years ago that I would be making these videos, I would be um, doing these things on YouTube, I would just look at you and be like, mm, you do not know me very well. <laughs> um, but I just want to let you guys know that continue to push yourself, continue to love yourself, and when you love yourself, it, it glows, you know, so many people even at work tell me, gosh, Thomas, you know, I see a great difference in you um, than a couple of years ago, you know, what, what's going on? And, and I said, basically, I am loving myself, you know, I love who I am as an individual. Um, there's no one like me, you know, I am a unique person and I'm going to be who I am, you know, I'm not going to be a follower you know, and follow crowds and, and everything. I'm going to be who I am. And if people don't accept me for who I am, then really, you know, it's it's their loss, you know, um, because this is who I am. This is who I am as a person, and I'm not going to change for anyone. And if those people do not love me for who I am, then really they don't need to be around me. So continue to press forward, and it will get better. I promise you it will get better, and you will look back and say, oh, my God, you know, and it's just amazing right now. And when that time comes, I hope that you will be a voice and share your story and share your words. And definitely give a video response to this and share your story because, believe me, um, if this helps one person, then this whole video was worth it. So I love each and every one of you. And if you want to talk to me or talk to anyone, you know, feel free. There's a Trevor, Trevor Project, um, org that you can go to, talk to your counselors, talk to anybody, but please talk. Don't hold it all in um, because that's when you will start crumbling down. You know, express your feelings and um, talk it out. And remember, you're not alone. We're with you and um, we love each and every one of you.